Hello, welcome to Rad System Studio. My name is Tuzik. In today's episode of Ad Page Properties, we're going to learn how to configure input field check duplicate validation. I'm working with a project I created by name Project 2. This project has three tables which includes customers, products and sales table. Now let's get started. On your left hand side, locate database table and select any table of your choice from your project. I'm going to use the customers table. On your immediate next column, locate and click on add pages. On the page fields column, we can see the list of fields from the table we selected. I'm going to use the phone field for this demonstration. Before we continue, let's publish our project and preview in browser. I'm going to navigate to our table of interest which is customers. Click on add new customers. Let's briefly fill this form and submit. As we can see this particular phone number appeared twice for two different users. Do how do we validate the phone number so it can be unique without duplication and error free? Let's drive back to Rad System Studios. The field properties, locate the validation section. This section has six properties but we're going to focus on the check duplicate property. Locate check duplicate field. By default, this field is set to false, but we can change it by clicking on the downward facing arrow next to the input field. From the drop down box options, select true option. Once done, let's publish our project and then preview in browser. I'm going to navigate to our table of interest which is customers. Click on add new customers. Let's briefly fill this form and try inputting the same phone number we used initially. Beautiful. Now as we can see, it was suggested to us as not available. This is to indicate that it has been taken by someone else. Until we input a number that doesn't existing already. We can do same for the email field. Let's drive back to Rad System Studios. On our page fields, use any field of your choice. I'm going to use the email field. By default, the text box type is set to email because the field name is email. If yours is set to text, kindly change it to email. Now, locate the validation section and click on check duplicate and set it to true. Once done, let's publish our project, preview in browser and refresh our page. Let's briefly fill this form. Because our field type is set to email, observe what happens when we try to input something that doesn't follow the email format. Do you notice it cannot be validated? This is awesome. Now we've learned how to check duplicates for input fields. Thank you for joining us today. Most importantly, if you've not subscribed to our channel, please subscribe for more tutorial videos like this and don't forget to like, comment and share. Hopefully, I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.